Hey, I'm NASA Kennedy's Anna Arvello, taking you inside KSC. The United Launch Alliance Atlas V first stage booster for NASA's next mission, the Tedris M, recently was transported from the Atlas Space Flight Operations Centers at Cape Canaveral Air Force Station to Space Launch Complex 41. Now positioned in the Vertical Integration Facility, the rocket Centaur upper stage and encapsulated spacecraft also will be lifted into place. NASA's Tracking and Data Relay Satellite, or Cheetahs M, is scheduled to lift off at 9.02 a.m. on August 3rd. The Churn Basin Wharf at NASA's Kennedy Space Center is undergoing upgrades to handle NASA's new Space Launch System rocket. The dock, which was used for offloading of external tanks during the Space Shuttle program, is now getting a makeover to accommodate the much larger SLS core stage when it arrives. The 212-foot-long core stage is more than 50 feet longer than the shuttle's tank. It serves as a structural backbone for the rocket designed to boost astronauts aboard the Orion spacecraft beyond low Earth orbit to destinations such as Mars. And remember, Spaceport Magazine digs deeper inside KSC.